In this lesson, we will enable and add the feedback activity in the Moodle course. Feedback activity allows a teacher to create custom surveys with variety of questions. But, by default the feedback module is disabled in Moodle. So, first we need to enable it. Scroll down, and expand, Site Administration block. Navigate to Plugins, and expand, Activity Modules. Then click, Manage Activities. This page holds all the activities and their status, whether enabled or hidden. You can also delete activities or change their default settings. Right now, Activity Name Feedback is hidden by default. Click, Hide Show icon, to enable this activity. Now the feedback activity is enabled and ready to use. Navigate to Courses in the Navigation block. And expand, Miscellaneous Category. Then, click on the course short name to view course main page. Now, click, Turn Edit and On. Scroll down to the third week of the course. Expand, Add an Activity drop-down menu. Now the feedback activity is available. So, select Feedback. Enter feedback activity name as, your opinion on course. Enter the description as, answer the following questions, to give opinion on the course so that we could improve it further. Scroll down to view other settings. Under the timing area, you can select the opening and close in time for the activity. Check, close the feedback at checkbox, to enter the close in time. Now, enter the close in time for the activity. Under Feedback Options, Expand, Record Usernames drop-down menu. You can either keep it to Anonymous, or set it to Log User's Name. For now let's leave it to default that is Anonymous. Expand, Show Analysis page after the submit. And select, Yes, to show the feedback analysis page, after the feedback is attempted. Then Expand, Send Email Notifications drop-down menu. And select, Yes, to send email notifications to the users after they are tempted the feedback. Further scroll down. In, Page After Submit text box, you can enter the message, the user would see after submitting the feedback. Enter the text, Thank you for your feedback. If you enter a URL in, URL for Continue button, the user will be redirected to the URL page whenever he clicks the Continue button. Click, Save and Return to Course. Then click, Turn Editing Off. Notice that the feedback activity has been added. Now, open your Moodle site in your computer and, implement the exercise before proceeding to the next video.